the topic is this, you know, so-called great resignation. What's going on here and, and what does it mean for, for sales leaders? This is going to be a big problem. I was on the phone with one global uh, HCM cloud company recently. They have over 200 AE roles open right now. They're struggling to fill the roles that they have to hit the growth goals that they want to hit. And on top of that, you know, that's not just that they're struggling to find, you know, warm bodies, they're struggling to find top talent. Organizations are, are self-limiting themselves with some of the, the, the criteria, the job descriptions that they themselves are putting out rather than attracting the talent that they're looking for. They're actually turning capable candidates away. A lot of times what you'll see is we want this many years of experience. It could be eight, it could be 10, it could be, I've seen 15 years of experience. And a lot of times you ask leaders, like, what's behind that? And they say, well, you know what? We want somebody who's ready to be selling on day one. But the question I guess I would say is like, what sort of sales experience are you delivering on that day one? We know it's that sales and, you know, buying is the cause of this is evolving. It's changing, you know, a challenger, we love to measure things. And so what do, what do we measure? We measure that buying and selling is evolving at about 25% a year. If, if a seller's not keeping pace with that rate of change in, in what it takes to create a good sales experience, it, it's likely that that could actually lead to a bad sales experience.